Well, as the woes for Sky Bahamas continue to build, first not having its airline operator certificate renewed, then being expelled from its spot at the Lyndon Pinling International Airport, and some staff members filing a trade dispute with the Department of Labor on Monday, Minister of Tourism and Aviation, the Honorable Dionisio de Aguila, says the actions of the Bahamas Civil Avi Aviation Authority are not responsible for the airline's problems. The minister says the BCAA is still reviewing Sky Bahamas for its air operator certificate and is moving towards making a decision soon. The Minister of Tourism also commented on if the airline's challenges will impact its future prospects. I mean, obviously um, the operator will have to evaluate that and they will have to see um, what the capital requirements are to, to uh, re-enter the market. Um, build with their brand back, attract customers back. Um, you know, they'll have to evaluate that and, and see what amount of capital will be necessary to do it and whether they have the capital to do it and the willingness to do it. So we'll have to see. Well, the Minister of Aviation also noted that renovation to the runway at the Lyndon Pindling International Airport is continuing. Renovations are being carried out to the tune of $20 million. Uh, we're hoping that it's completed before Thanksgiving. I mean, obviously, the Linden Pinning International Airport is operating on a single runway, and um, there is no redundancy in place right now. Um, we have in place um, the necessary uh, infrastructure and equipment to ensure that um, should an incident happen on the runway, we can clear it and get it back in operation as quickly as possible, as you would have seen. I believe it was last week there was an incident, and within 90 minutes, the plane was was removed and, uh, and, the, and the airport was back in operation. So the airport has been operating very smoothly, very few delays, um, but obviously as Thanksgiving approaches, um, we start to get a little bit nervous because um, obviously the, uh, the load will increase and we would like the runway operational by then. We've